Okay, I'm Rabbi Moshe Perry, and I have a few uh, choice words on the occasion, on the choice of the uh, events that just took place. Now, it may have been just a kid out fooling around and thinking that he was uh, going to be tough and give uh, something to talk about with his friends of how he, uh, he made some Jew scared, some Jewish kid. But the bottom line is, this has to stop. Jewish people have taken it for long enough. We are the people of the Tanakh, of the Bible, where when stories of our conquest of Eretz Yisrael and our fighting of all our enemies around Eretz Yisrael, the land of Israel, the, the world was afraid of our army. And not for nothing did did rocks fall from the sky in defense of the Jewish people by God, bringing miracles and Nisim to save the Jewish people in battle after battle against their far superior enemies, far, uh, far, far outnumbering us, out arming us on on the on the paper on the battlefield. We were we were less tall, less less strong than them, less proficient we weren't a warrior class we were just slaves coming out of Egypt and we took care of them with God's help this is what we need to do we need to get to be the people that God gave miracles to to protect us from being attacked every time we're attacked God is attacked every time we're attacked it's anti-semitism it's Jew hatred it is also a chilul Hashem a desecration of God's name and America Hanna said Rabbi America Hanna said Hashem Yenachem Dhamma the only way to remove a Chilol Hashem is by doing a Kiddush Hashem. Not by doing a Kiddush Hashem of learning Torah or making more settlements when, when, when terrorists kill Jews in Eretz Israel. Not by saying Tehillim or giving Tzedakah, but by, by standing up and fighting. We are, we, are the, we are the students and the followers and the subjects of our king, King David. And we're supposed to follow our avos, our, the example they set for us, both in Mitzrayim when they were standing up to the Egyptians with the Korban Pesach and throwing themselves into the Amsuf in order to encourage the miracle that Hashem split the sea to save us from the Egyptian army, to Shmuel and Navi, to Samuel the prophet, to hacking the king of, of Amalek to death, who, who des deserved what he got for trying to attack the Jewish people and for having killed so many people in a bloodlust all throughout his career. The bottom line is Jewish people today are not acting like and emulating the Jewish people of yore. And as a result, we're not having these miracles. We get these miracles when we rise up. When we take a stand for Hashem in the world and we're not afraid to answer fire with fire, that's when Hashem has always given us miracles. When we took their God in Egypt and slaughtered it in front of their faces in the Korban Pesach. When we jumped into the Amso, when David, David and Melech is our king, when we walked out, he walked out to face Goliath. He didn't have to do that, but it was a Chil Hashem. He said, who is this Philistine um, uncircumcised Philistine to, to taunt the army of the living God. And he went out to take him out. And that's when he earned the right to have a miracle. People tell me all the time, they tell me all the time, well, we have to wait because we're not holy enough, we're not uh, righteous enough. And the, the, all those wars were miraculous. Yeah, they were miraculous, not just because the people were tzaddikim that were fighting those wars, but because they took the, had the courage and they had the, and they had the, 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 uh, dedication, Messiris Nefesh, to Hashem, to walk out onto a battlefield to, to confront our enemies. The Hashmanoim had no chance when they were just Kohanim. They were not trained in war. They faced the whole entire Greek empire. But because they took the chance and they were willing to stand up for Torah and for the Jewish people and for Eretz Yisrael, and especially for Hashem in the world, that his name shouldn't be desecrated by how the Jewish people are being treated, that's when... Hashem acted to make great miracles to save us all throughout history. And he'll do the same thing again in our time period if we rise up. We have to arise, rise yourselves, and with pride, stand up and not take this anymore. We have to answer fire with fire.